not the face. Okay. Okay. Nah, man. It's not worth the trouble with the police. What the fuck? What the fuck? I'm just doing some spring cleaning. Hey, you want something to drink? No, I'm fine, Dad. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Here's some medicine. Thanks. What do you say you give your old man a hug? How about making us some tea? Yeah, that sounds good. Okay. Yeah. Did you look into that stuff I asked you to? I don't get it, Dad. I mean, what do you need to find Alex for? I got a plan. What sort of plan? Do you want him to help you find a job or something? No. Is that what this desperate search is all about? He's an asshole, Dad. I thought you would figure that out by now. I know what he's like, sweetie. That's why I need to find him. I just hope you know what you're doing. Trust me, Annie. I've got it all figured out. Hmm. So, you gonna spill the beans or what? <laughs> well, uh, he works for an investment company out of... New York? Yeah. Okay. Um, but he's here right now, working on an acquisition in San Francisco. But I don't know where he's staying. Well, if he's here, I'll find him. Jim? Oh, really? Okay, I'll take care of it. Well, that's what you pay me for. <laughs> the buyout was not an ideal solution. Is Dilipin? He is conducting his weekly meeting. Okay. I can send him in when he's finished. Operationally, though, nothing changes. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. How are we all? Hi. Dilip? Alex. Alex. You cannot barge into my meetings. You're undermining me. I don't think you need to worry about being undermined anymore, Dilip. Or your team meetings either, for that matter. What the hell is that supposed to mean? Well, it's with great regret that I have to inform you that your services are no longer required. This is my company. I cannot be replaced. No one is indispensable, Dilip, including myself. 
Now, the deal that you did with us is what we in the private equities world called a distressed asset sale. In short, your company was in trouble, you needed cash, so you came to us. Now it's up to us to right-size the business. Cut out the fat. And I'm the fat? We need to clean house, Mr. Singh. Strip out the redundant parts of the business. Monetize the valuable ones. It's nothing personal. It's just what we do. has the power to possess and to open up fresh ideas of possibility in thinking and action. Alex. Morgan. What the hell are you doing here? Well, nice to see you too, pal. I'm sorry, I, you surprised me. Yeah, I bet I did. It's been a while. But you look good. Mr. Wall Street, as always. Well, you know what they say. Clothes make it the man. What are you gonna have? Scotch? No thanks. So, what brings you here? You don't believe in serendipity? Oh, I do. But something tells me there's a bit more to this particular coincidence. You want something? Life hasn't been very kind to you, has it? What a fucked up thing to say. Come on, Morgan. We had a fun ride while it lasted. A fun ride? My career destroyed? My reputation ruined? It's a miracle I didn't go to jail. Oh, I'm sorry that if you don't have the balls to deal with a little adversity. Excuse me, I'm gonna pat my neck. Should have held your ground, man. I held my ground. Three days in court hearings, and then seven months of the SEC dragging my ass through a fucking ringer. Calm the hell down, Morgan. They came after me too. I just fought them off. Yeah, by blaming me for all your financial shenanigans. You know what? Stop being so fucking dramatic. You signed off everything. And your fingerprints were everywhere. That's because I trusted you, ma'am. You took advantage of me, Alex. We worked together for five years side by side and built a company from scratch. And you set me up. Betrayed me. So what do you want? Not here. My apartment tomorrow evening, seven-ish. Sorry, my schedule's full tomorrow. We can talk in the back room if you want. This isn't the time or the place, okay? You're out with your girl. Have some fun. And we'll talk later, okay? Who was that? Nobody. For you, Julia, you definitely look like a somebody. Come on, let's get out of here. Now. 
So are we going to dinner later tonight? I'm sorry, did I say I was taking you out for dinner tonight? No, I, I just figured. You know what? You can go to hell for all I care. Listen, monkey. I have to go and see a friend. He needs my help. A friend? In San Francisco? Are you serious? Alex, we both know you don't have any friends. You know what? Just because I fuck you, it doesn't qualify you to be my shrink. Maybe not. But it does qualify me to judge your performance in bed. Yeah, well, I'm sorry it doesn't meet your high standards. Fuck, man. You really need to get your act together. What a great segue. That's precisely the reason why I invited you here. Well, it's not as though I hadn't guessed last night. I can make some calls. I'm not interested in a job, Alex. Okay. So what did you have in mind? Have you ever heard of the prisoner's dilemma? The game theory stuff? Yeah, it's an economic experiment, if you will. Only more emphatic. What do you say? Shall we act it out? What can I say? I'm a captive audience. The rules are simple. I will present you with two choices. Whatever you choose, I by default must go along with the other. And what are the choices? Kill or be killed. You're right, if you fucking mind. Sit your ass down, Alex! You're acting like you've chosen number two. Sit down. Why are we doing this? Indeed, why am I? By rights, I should just put this gun to your head and blow it to fucking kingdom come. Morgan. We don't have to do this. I can fix this for you. This is a chance of a lifetime for me, okay? I am a stone among stones. I am a waste of life. If I die, I'm worth a million dollars in insurance money, and that's my redemption. Well, your redemption isn't worth me going to prison for. Alex, it's a foolproof plan. Look around. The stage is set. A single gunshot to the heart. Nobody even knows that you're here. You walk out, end of story. She needs a fucking shrink. I don't need to see a shrink! I need a goddamn executioner! Otherwise, my daughter's not gonna see a dime of that money. And it's your absolution. Mine? Yeah. What the fuck has this got to do with me? You, my friend, get to finish what you started. You left me for dead once, now put me down for good. I'm sorry, man. You got the wrong guy. I'm not a killer. I'm willing to bet that you are. Take the fucking gun. I'm not taking the gun. Take the goddamn gun! Fucking psycho. I'm Take the fucking you. gun! No, Take the fucking gun! Take the fucking gun and do it now! Fucking cunt. Thank you.